Hello, today I'll show you how to put an iPhone portal on your PSP. So first you have to go on the site I'll post in the, in the description. It's going to look like this, iPSP. Go down until you get to easy installer or manual install. Now um, I'll show you today how to use manual install. So you click on it and you download it. Then when we're will open it if you have it now you have to select IPSP which is the first one this you have to extract it extract it here to anywhere I suggest a desktop so now once it's on your desktop you'll have this thing in the bottom you you have to now connect your PSP and in the common in once you open it you go in the PSP folder and then in the common folder and you put and you drag it in there once this is when this is done disconnect your PSP Okay, now go into the internet browser. And into address entry. Okay, now you have to write, you have, you're going to have to type it and type in a website, which I'll post in the description. I'll just show you, now I'll do it. So it's gonna look file slash common slash I P S P. It's the name of the app. Now while while I do this, I just want to tell you that you it this app re the portal requires any firmware above 2.71. So it could be custom firmware or anything. It has to be above 2.71. Okay, so once you put in the site, you en enter. Now it's gonna come up. Yes, run the plugin. And now's the fun part, because you got yourself iPhone on your PSP. Okay, uh, this isn't touch screen, you know. But uh, many cool things. So you have. Um, weather oh. you have games the browser um, about you can lock it to make it look like the real iPhone except you can't slide it to unlock you know nothing happens and that's well pretty much it Uh, there are so many many games. Uh, uh, also, I want to show you that the browser in it in in the in this in this app is isn't like the real Safari browser as the icon shows. It's just some normal browser, but N a little nicer than the one that's on the real PSP, but still, uh, Safari is much better. Uh, I sh um, I made a video showing how to put the real Safari in your PSP. I'll also post that in the link. Okay, thanks for watching.